All right. Uh, welcome to 656 Sports and Things. My name is Nathan, and it's coming. There's a rumor going around that Chris Paul will be joining the Los Angeles Lakers. It's not confirmed, but we are hearing it. Don't be surprised when it happens. I understand why the Lakers would want to play with LeBron and Anthony Davis would want to play with Chris Paul. I do. I don't understand why the Oklahoma City Thunder would let him go. Let's be real. If Lakers want someone bad enough, they're probably going to get them. I, I don't know what the Lakers have to give Oklahoma City Thunder in, a, in far of as, as... When I know how to talk, I'll let you know. As far as assets goes, they did trade a lot of their assets to get Anthony Davis last year. So how many assets do they have left? And if I'm an Oklahoma City Thunder fan, how do you feel? You were in the finals in 2012, and since then, you lost three MVPs, Harden with the Rockets, Durant went to Golden State and really upset everyone. Westbrook, you know, went off. I'm, I'm going to... So there's three Hall of Famers right there who left your team since 2012. Outside of that, you had Paul George playing there last year. But now, you know, I, I, I know I just signed a, you know, a deal with Oklahoma City and said I'd stay here and all that fun jazz. But Kawhi's in the Clippers, and, and I, and I want to play with Kawhi. Like, I'm sorry, Oklahoma City. I, I really like you and everything, but I'm going to go play play with Kawhi. I'm going to play with my friends in L.A. Like, sure, you guys. So you bring in Chris Ball. You make the playoffs of the seventh seat this year, you, and you almost upset the Rockets. The same team that your former face of the franchise was on. So, like, I understand you might want to rebuild, and I understand why the Thunder would do this to try to save money. Chris Ball does have a $41 million a year salary that you would perhaps like to get off the books and you know maybe you can swing a deal with the Raptors you get the Raptors <laughs> you can swing a deal with the Raptors Raptors fan uh you can swing a deal with the Lakers and maybe get Kuzma you know maybe get some draft pieces but how much draft capital do the Lakers even have after just you know bending over and selling the firm you know to get Anthony Davis do the, the, do the Lakers need Chris Paul? Probably not. They just won a championship. Would it help? Yeah, probably. I think he's an upgrade over Kuzma, but I don't think you need him. I mean, if you're a Lakers fan, you're, you probably are still a little pissed off about not getting Chris Paul when he was traded from the Hornets. That deal happened. You're still probably a little pissed off about that. But I understand, but I understand that they're trying to sell Chris Paul to save money. But why are you doing it? Why are you trying to get another big three? You just won a championship. I don't understand. It's the Lakers and you want Showtime and all that fun jazz to come back. But from a basketball point, it just doesn't make a lot of sense. I don't think you have a lot of assets to get that deal done. Maybe I'm wrong. I just don't know why this deal is happening, why the potential there is happening. I don't know why Oklahoma City Thunder are trying to trade Chris Paul. You were just in the playoffs. Nobody had you making the playoffs. Nobody, not even diehard Thunder fans, had you making the playoffs. So since 2012, if this deal goes through, since 2012, you would have lost James Harden, former MVP, first ballot Hall of Famer. Kevin Durant, former MVP and the scoring champion, first ballot Hall of Famer. Russell Westbrook, former MVP, has a averages a triple-double almost every year, first ballot Hall of Famer. You lose George who's a multiple-time All-NBA player, right? Easily a Hall of Famer. Probably not a first ballot. He goes, you get Chris Paul for a year. You make the playoffs of his seventh seat and you trade him? That's a hard sell for your fans, man. Oh, we were just in the playoffs, but now we're rebuilding. We need to rebuild and get younger. What? Just one more season, man? Make a run? If it doesn't work, then move on. That's just my take. Are you going to trade Chris Paul? What's next? Are you going to trade Steven Adams? This doesn't make a lot of sense to me from a basketball point. I understand the Lakers wanting him. I can kind of see that they're trying to save money, but let me know what you think. Um, 
think Chris Paul works in a, a Lakers uniform? A lot of Lakers fans are saying yes. Of course they are. Uh, anyway, thank you for checking out 656 Sports and Things today. You all have a great day, and I'm sure I'll be chatting with you again soon. Bye.